trucks. Well, it was a cold start to our day. We're going to continue to see cold temperatures, but plenty of sunshine. So on the sunny side of the street, it feels pretty nice. Maybe not so much on the other side. We are right now, they're taking a look right now south of San Angelo, 37 right downtown. And we're seeing winds coming in from the north at 7 miles per hour. So it is going to feel a little bit colder with the wind chills for a few of us. But we're slowly slowly but surely getting above freezing for most of us. We're seeing Brady at 30 and Big Lake at 30 as well. So most of us okay. are seeing above freezing temperatures right now as we head into the afternoon. Now a few combinations of some things are going to make it feel a little interesting out there today because like I said we do have some winds out there about 5 to 10 miles per hour some a little bit stronger we're seeing Ozono at 12 Sonora at 13 so a little bit stronger winds with the combinations of that and the temperatures make it feel a little bit colder so we saw it was pretty cold this morning we're gonna see it's gonna feel a little bit colder this afternoon but with sunshine it'll have a few breaks from the wind it'll feel somewhat nicer out there. So that's why I said a combination of the wind, the temperatures, the sunshine, and just all of that thing is going to make it kind of feel a little bit warmer out there to you. So temperatures are going to be getting into the mid 40s for a lot of us. So like I said, but we will see one or two degrees cooler as it feels as we go into the evening. We could see one or two degrees cooler out there because of the wind, but then we could see if you're on the sunny side of the street, like I said, it could feel a little bit nicer than what it actually is. And then we're going to see another cold evening out there for your Wednesday, getting below freezing again. We're actually going to see winds starting to die down a little bit and coming in from the south. So we're actually going to see just cold temperatures, but we'll see that warm air coming into our area by Wednesday. You just got to get through a cold Tuesday, 45, and plenty of sunshine. So like I said, maybe take a walk on the sunny side of the street, even though tonight's going to be in those mid-20s. We're slowly going to be seeing winds changing and coming in from the south for Wednesday and Thursday. And we do have some light rain chances. Most of it's going to be overnight, early into the morning, Wednesday, Thursday. So that's where we're going to keep an eye on it. It's going to be some light showers, mostly staying south of our area as we've kind of kept an eye on on as it's gone through because we're just going to see warmer air coming in finally getting to the 60s by Thursday 65 by Friday and even 67 on Saturday so we're seeing plenty of southerly flowing winds coming in going to be warming us up nicely for the weekend even mid 60s again another little light shower looking at 10 percent on that one so it's going to be very light not much anything crazy out there than some 70s finally on Monday. So it seems like the pattern like this past weekend we had 70s but then we had a strong cold front come through and that's what gave us the cold day Monday and a cold day today but we will see it slowly warm back up before we have any changes really on the way.